Good morning and welcome back to the channel. We are about to show you guys a rather interesting hoof. All there was was a little tiny stone that got wedged in and it caused her a lot of discomfort. So let's get her in the chute, let's get her up in the air and let's see if we can make her feel a little bit better. Let's go. So, she's in the crush. We're gonna wash this hoof off and make it much easier for us to see all this damage around this hoof. And we're gonna start removing all these loose layers of horn. And as you can see, there are already some big stones wedged in this hoof that we're gonna need to remove to make this girl feel much more comfortable. You'll notice here that there's some like water dripping off the hoof. This is me just using my chlorhexidine spray just to try and flush any of these last bits of stones and sand and grit out of this hoof rather than ruining my knives by catching them with them because they absolutely destroy the blades and the edge of these knives as soon as we touch a stone. And as you can see, we need these sharp knives and we need to be very delicate when we're trimming this hoof. So we are now just gonna rough up this hoof. We're gonna get a little bit of an edge on it just so it makes it much easier for us to get a good glue contact. Give the hoof just a little bit of heat and then we will get to gluing on a shoe. I'm sure all of you guys can admit this green glue looks really cool on these feet. And if you look at the other hoof in the background here, she actually had digital dermatitis on that hoof. And because she's a little cow, she doesn't look the most comfortable in here. But I assure you, this belly band is taking all the weight of her buddy and supporting her perfectly comfortable. So she is not going to be bothered while she's in here at all. And we have nearly finished this trim, so she isn't going to be here much longer. We're just going to trim down the fine little margins that are left, and then we're going to let her go. Yeah, it was literally there was like a little stone here and it had like grown right in over the top. But it fractured a little bit as well. So she's all wrapped up and now we're going to watch her leave and we're going to see if she walks out feeling just a little bit better than how she walked in. The cows don't normally walk through that bit, that's why it's not the cleanest. Where they're walking, here where I am right now, it's pretty clean, but look. Straight out, straight to eating. Now all that was was a little stone wedged in her hoof. Would you guys believe 
a stone like that can cause so much damage to that hoof. Very surprised. So we are finished. We're finished for the day. We trimmed 40 something cows. Don't see much of any interest other than that last cow. Don't forget, give us a big subscribe. We'll catch you guys on the next video.